manufacturing sector here in BC accounts for over 400,000 jobs, either directly or indirectly. So it's a very exciting field. There's a lot of demand for qualified engineers in that field. We partnered with a lot of the leading names in the manufacturing sector. So we're really giving students an opportunity to get hands-on experience with the equipment and the software and the processes that they are likely to see when they graduate and join the manufacturing sector themselves. And there's been a big push for flexibility and adaptability and modularity in the manufacturing sector. And our lab reflects that. Students are able to break apart the system. They can take it to individual computer stations, reprogram it, reconfigure the entire system and gives them a really good understanding of what the state of the art is in the manufacturing sector. We have the traditional industrial automation topics that we teach, so PLCs and traditional control systems, but then we also have this higher level type of control system or enterprise type system, which allows us to control things from our smartphones, connect our system to the internet, and be able to get a lot of data and perform analytics on the manufacturing systems. In addition to our degree program, we've also been developing a micro-credential program that people from the industry can participate in so they can brush up their skills in some of the industrial automation topics that we cover in manufacturing. But we've also integrated those into our degree program as well. So our students are not only getting the degree from UBC, but they can also get these micro-credentials, which they can share with potential employers. It's a fast-paced industry. For example, the pandemic, where we needed to reconfigure our manufacturing facilities to create PPE. We definitely need to be adaptable, and it's really how we solve problems these days.